Hey everybody, Scott Sponsor here, DocSports.com, and welcome to our free Korean baseball report for Wednesday's card. We'll get to the free pick in just a moment. Before I get to that, a real quick note, I'm in UFC action on Wednesday. My premium picks over at DocSports.com will be posted at 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific on Wednesday morning. Anytime after that, you can go grab the picks if you're interested. Uh, we had a big six-unit play this past weekend. We had Nganyu by knockout or TKO, and obviously he picked up the big knockout less than a minute into round number one so we cashed that six unit got another six unit going on a wednesday's card and again you'll be able to pick that up after 11 30 a.m eastern on wednesday docsports.com we had that 70 percent run in the fight game all of january all of february we picked up almost three thousand dollars for 100 dollar per unit betters and then of course march hit and you saw what happened so uh, a winner last week uh, we went one and one we lost a two star we won the six star so we ended up nicely ahead for the day and again a six unit play goes going on Wednesday's card, so check that out. Soccer coming back on Friday. We'll be heavily involved in soccer this upcoming weekend, and as you know, we're involved in Korean baseball, Taiwan baseball each and every day of the week. Uh, my KBO and my Taiwan baseball, which is CPBL, uh, is updated for premium picks every single day of the week, 3.30 p.m. Eastern, 12.30 p.m. Pacific time. Uh, that's when you can grab those premium picks over at DocSports.com. Haven't been involved every day in the CPBL, the Taiwan League. There's only four teams, and so you kind of have to pick and choose your spots over there but uh, we are undefeated since Saturday with our baseball plays uh, we won again our premium pick yesterday uh, we had an over and in a total that uh, zoomed over the total by the way a seven to six game that involved Despagne if you remember him from what he pitched in the states and of course uh, boy the NC Dinos they like to hit the baseball don't they they've got a bullpen that can give up some runs so that was our overplay on uh, our premium play on Tuesday morning to cash for us we did lose our first free premium or excuse me, my first free video KBO pick uh, so far this season we were 5-0 and going into Tuesday morning and we had a runs line play our team won 3-2 obviously did not cover the run and a half and so 5-1 uh, and one with the free picks on fire we've swept everything in baseball since Saturday right through Tuesday's games with my premium picks over at DocSports.com you can still get my premium pick for Wednesday's card the games go at 5 30 a.m eastern 2 30 a.m pacific and one happens to be a big seven star play for me in wednesday's korean baseball and again you can get it right now you can get it up until about midnight a little bit after midnight eastern time and uh, that game goes again at 5 30 a.m eastern time so jump on board if you wish hey, a couple of real quick notes before i get to the free pick uh, first of all check out my ufc free pick video it will be posted on tuesday night by 11 p.m eastern 8 p.m pacific we'll have a free pick for wednesday's fight card and also wanted to mention what's going on COVID-19's effect on North American sports uh, we saw the owners give a really nice deal for an 82 game season to start around the 4th of July it's now in the hands of the players they've offered to split 50-50 revenue with the players have no idea what the revenue is going to be because there's likely not going to be any fans in the stands uh, potentially for the entire season certainly uh, the first month or so and so we don't know what that revenue will be but they kind of reached out and of course the players now have to accept it as far as I'm concerned let's get it going if you don't want to play you don't have to no hard feelings bring the next guy up fill him in at the position of his choice NBA should be going guys come on man you might not agree with me but the NBA should be going uh, there's a ton of arenas in Las Vegas all within about a four or five mile drive of each other Mandalay Bay MGM Orleans Thomas and Mack Cox Pavilion there's five arenas and you don't even need arenas because you're not gonna have fans of the stands the MGM I think was one of the properties that talked about uh, putting down courts temporary courts they've got convention rooms that have huge high ceilings so you don't have to worry about that and and uh, they can play away. Uh, I just get the feeling that the owners of the players uh, don't really seem to want to get it going as of right now. And they can't be coddled or treated any safer than they're already being proposed to do so. It'd be almost in a, a bubble effect, you know, almost in a biodome type of effect if these players got back under the underway, whether it be in the Bahamas, whether it be in Las Vegas, whether it be in Florida. Uh, the bottom line is if they really want to get at it, they're going to get at it and going to play. The rest of us, like you out there watching these videos, when you go back to work, you look at that kind of protection these guys are going to get so listen i know everybody's got to make up their own mind not here to tell anybody what they should be doing but my own personal opinion is that the nba 
could very well be back underway by now. Okay, just my own non-medical opinion. Let's get to our free pick in the KBO uh, for Wednesday morning, Scott. It starts at 5.30 a.m. Eastern, 2.30 a.m. Pacific. And I am talking about the game between the SK Wyverns, who are off to a really rough start after having the best record in the regular season last year. SK taking on LG, the Twins. The total sitting at 9.5. Um, Going to be pretty close to even money as far as the over is concerned. So, you know, we're going towards the over. Listen, I know uh, Pinto had a good start. Ricardo Pinto for SK in his first start of the season. And uh, he actually pitched well, six and two-thirds. Only gave up one earned run, struck out three, walked three. Uh, only gave up, uh, what was it, three hits in that first start against Hanwha. His projected 2020 numbers are much higher than what he did in that opening start. And his fastball was working well, there's no doubt about it, but also got to take into effect the team that he was going against. But his 2020 projections, you're talking about an ERA of over 4.7, a whip approaching 1.5. I don't know that he's going to be able to have the kind of success that he did in the opening start for him uh, this last week for SK, talking about Ricardo Pinto. Uh, and what we do know about both of these teams is they have bad bullpens. They're not good. And uh, so look at, you're looking at SK, who hasn't been at their best, yet half of their games have gone over the total. The LJ Twins, Five, excuse me, LG Twins, five of their six games so far have gone over the total. I, I don't think that these teams are going to be able to keep the scoring down. I, I really believe that when the bullpens come in, uh, it's going to be a, a, a situation where they're going to score enough runs to be able to go over that posted total of nine and a half. So we're going to recommend to play a free pick on SK and LG over the total of nine and a half. Don't forget, again, right now up until about midnight, you can grab my Wednesday morning premium pick. We look to stay perfect since Saturday on the bases. It's available on my homepage at DocSports.com. And also don't forget to check out the UFC video if you're interested in UFC, as I will have a free pick video up by 11 p.m. Eastern, 8 p.m. Pacific, Tuesday night, running right up until fight time on Wednesday. And my premium UFC picks will be available at DocSports.com at 11.30 a.m. Eastern on Wednesday. Six star play tops the card in UFC for me on Wednesday. It's going to do it for me. If you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe so you'll know when the videos go up. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com. Let's start a new win streak with our free picks in KBO. Let's go to 6-1. and one. We'll talk to you again Wednesday night by 8 p.m. Eastern to 10 p.m. Eastern time for Thursday's card. We'll see you then.